inside corner, strike one. And he starts to go after it. Question was, did he hold up in time? Yes, indeed, says the third base umpire. The 1-1. And here's a pitch swung on and missed one and two now. Now here's the pitch. Good hard sinker, but he lays off to even things at two and two. Not the first time he's felt the squeeze tonight. Yeah, he's looking and saying, what do I got to do to get a strike? Now a ball hit in the air, but in play perhaps down the line. And he will run this one down, moving to his right. And that's the first out of the inning. Right fielder, Damian. Trejo. Damian Trejo is in for the third time as he looks at a ball high. It's 1-0. and And even though he's pitching well, this is a part of the order that he's really got to worry about. Now they can turn a good outing into a bad one pretty darn quickly. Collins is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for route number two. First pitch coming. Michael Franco is in with two away as he takes a ball, 1-0. Here's a 1-0. And that's swung on and fouled straight back. And the pitch. That nibbled the corner there but missed, 2-1. And, and now a pitch on the way. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. You have to say, they've really had a good game plan for attacking the three, four, five hitters all game. And hold that thought as that's a strikeout for route number three. So the inning will come to an end. Add another zero as it's up to seven shutout innings so far. Frank Rutherford will stand in to start out their half of the eighth with that starter still out there. And he's definitely been a tough nut to crack. No, he's been dominant all game long. And I think part of it is that he got himself a nice lead early on, and that's allowed him to not really worry about making a mistake. He's been free and easy the whole way through. Swing and a line drive to left, and a base hit, so the leadoff man is aboard. Mike Lozano will try it again. He's grounded out and struck out in two trips. Now here's the first pitch. Hit high and deep toward the corner and right. And it's a that foul ball. ball. Hey, you pitch, you pitch right Comes set, now the pitch. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. But this will wind up a foul ball, strike two. He's ready, now the pitch. Too high, one and two. A look here at the hits per side here in the late going. And he struck him out. Good pitch there as he registers his eighth punch out of the ball game. Cesar Hernandez will stand in now. He flew out in his first time around and then was a strikeout victim last time. Waved at and missed, and he's behind 0-2. Boy, I'll tell you, to be down 0-2 against a guy like this with the stuff he's got tonight, not a comfortable spot to be in. Darren Mastriani will stand in now. He struck out and flied out 0-2 thus far. And he starts the number eight hitter with a strike, nothing in one. That's in there as well. It's a quick 0-2 count. Jammed him there as this is rolled out to short. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. He's through eight with the shutout intact. We've played eight full. The Mudheads are on top, nine to nothing. Lance Caton will stand in now to begin their half of the ninth in a game that was decided long, long ago. Yeah, this is mop-up time out there right now, but hey, these at-bats still count against your batting average, so you can't go up there and just mail it in. You've got to see this through right to the end of the game. Sinker, one ball, one strike. Swing and a miss on the sinker, and it's one and two. Pitch on the way. And here's a ball lifted back toward the stands in right, so we'll try it again at one and two. Now another one, two. Swing and a liner toward right center. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. And he's in there safely. He's got a double. 
Jeff Escalona will step in now as his guys look for a breakthrough here with a runner in scoring position. Yeah, and it's been a long time coming. They haven't done anything with their opportunities so far. Maybe this will be the time that they finally crack the scoreboard. Here's a late swing and a miss, strike two. And there's not a whole lot of conviction in that swing. It was almost like an afterthought, like an emergency hack. And he struck him out. So double digits now, 10 strikeouts for him thus far. Now the first pitch. Ray Palacios stands in as he checks his swing here for strike one. That man's team has definitely shot itself in the foot with all the strikeouts so far. It seems like it's been a growing trend so far, but man, you've just got to be able to put the ball in play when you've got runners in scoring position. Hit on the ground is short. In time to first, and there are two away. Damian Trejo will stand in now as their last shot here with two away in the ninth. Yeah, just one final hurdle here before he finishes off the shutout. Here's a sinker to start him out, but he wouldn't bite. It's ball one. Chased a bad one there, one and one. He's set, now the pitch. Swing and a grounder fouled off to the left. Now the one-two. Swing and a miss, he struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Time for one final check of the line score as you see the key players there in this shutout victory. And guys, you can't win if you can't score, so there's probably not a whole lot of debate about who'll take home tops player of the game honors in this one. Yeah, definitely no no debate as far as I'm concerned. He was really in complete control. Inside the show with Justin Allegri. Welcome back. Matt Vaskersian here as the guys and I bring you closer to first pitch on the MLB pregame show with tonight's installment of the Bowman Prospect Spotlight. Craig Wagoner is highlighted here. And if you haven't heard of him before, that might be because he's playing his first major league ball game here today. Tommy LaStella will step in now to lead things off in the home half of the first. Third baseman, Tommy LaStella. Come on, guys. Get your pitch up there. 
Starts him out with a sinker that's inside, 1-0. Eric, you take a look at our visiting club as they take the field tonight here in the bottom of the first. They'll look to make it three straight here as they come in on the heels of two straight wins. And the thing about baseball is that each new day brings a new opportunity. So we'll see if these guys are up to the task here. Gets the call on the changeup there, 2-1. Here we go, boys. Here it comes, 2-1. Now here's a bouncing ball headed for Iglesias at short. One away. Dexter Fowler will stand in, and he's been tearing the cover off the ball the past few days, as you see his numbers from the last five ball games. And here's a swing and another chance out there at short. Throw in time at first for route number two. Anthony Rizzo will stand in. A big power threat here to say the least, currently third in home runs in the National League. Swing and a liner, but foul. Now the pitch. Grounded foul toward the third base dugout. And the pitch. Swung on and taken the opposite way out toward deep left center. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. The relay and the gamble will work out. He's in at second base with a two out double. Jorge Soler will get his first opportunity here. And that average is certainly not where he wants it down in the 220s to begin the ball game. Here's a sinker to start him out, but he wouldn't bite. It's ball one. All of a sudden, you got to be careful now with the cleanup guy up there with a runner in scoring position. He could be in danger of giving up that first run after all. Ready now on one and one. One one pitch is a sinker taken for a strike one and two. You'd have to say, so far, so good here for the rookie. Yeah, I mean, he's getting ahead, he's mixing his pitches. You'd like to put up a zero to get that first inning out of the way, and he's close to making that happen. Now a swing and a ball pulled down the line to third. But a foul ball as it holds it two and two. Two, two. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. Come on, baby. Let me pitch up there. Here we go now. Come on now. Two, two pitch on the way. Full count. Three and two. Whoa, that one definitely took off on him right there. He's lucky that thing didn't go all the way to the backstop. Now a swing and a bouncing ball toward the hole. And nothing will come of the two-out double as the inning is over. Craig Wagoner will stride to the box as he gets ready for his first A.B. of the year. Get ahead, stay ahead right here. First pitch on the way. Hey, come on now. This here ball's hit in the air down the right side and out of play. 0 and 1. He's ready now, the pitch. Now a swing and a ground ball, but this will be a foul ball as he's behind 0 and 2 now. Hey, put him away. He's set, now the pitch. And he'll try to get him to chase the fastball there, but he lays off one and two. E.K., as we look at the Cubs entering play here tonight, they come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. And this time of year is really starting to catch up with these guys now. They've been fairly lifeless here in these past few games. Bullpen's tired, the starters are tired. Heck, everybody's tired. 
but you've got to find a way to push through it. And how about that? His first major league hit. There might not be too many more to come, seeing he's a pitcher, so an exciting moment for him for sure. And good hitting pitchers are a luxury for a manager to have. Not that this one hit is going to prove that he'll be a good hitting pitcher, but some pitchers do take it really seriously. 